2012, I decided to venture and grow the business into Southeast Asia. Obviously, I was looking for another iconic World Heritage Site, the Mekong, that flows through six, seven countries. And whilst you navigate and explore life on the river between Vietnam and Cambodia, remember, Cambodia has 14 million people, Vietnam has 95 million people. Big contrast in cultures and big contrast in history as well. And to see it on a 20 cabin cruiser, beautifully designed. I wanted always to create a brand that had recognition and that was also not considered primarily just a travel brand, but also a lifestyle brand. So we've partnered up with designers, interior designers, the boutique lifestyle managers that create these authentic experiences for our guests. It allows everybody to explore on twice daily excursions off the main vessel and a fleet of four private tenders, of which we're the only vessel that caters to this type of experience. Uh, twice the excursions exploring floating markets, temples, backwater rural communities by bike, speedboat, kayaks, or tuk-tuks, or walking if you want. And so really, it's the only way to do it, it's the only way I would do it, and I think it's the only way I recommend my guests to do it. I partnered up and I hired uh, David Thompson. He's created a culinary journey from Vietnam through into Cambodia, you know, capturing all the flavors from that part of the world. It's my staff that sets it all apart. That human touch is really what allows us to elevate and not only deliver on guest expectations, but exceed them. They welcome you with a smile. They know your name within the next day. I've got a one-to-one -one guest crew ratio. And the amount of time and commitment we give our staff, I believe, has been my best investment yet. I'm often asked why I started Aqua Expeditions, and usually my response is, come experience it for yourself. You've got to create your own memories. I want people to use our platforms, our vessels, to get an insight into these parts of the world, but you know, do it in their own time, on their own pace, and with their own uh, families.